Where are you? I've never felt like this before. You feel so far away. Please, God. I'm so sorry for that. The presence behind me. I have to run. Run out. Run, but I can't move. God, please. I can't move. God, please! <laughs> the beast is... is gone. A tall man, robed in alabaster. So out of place here. Alan. Please come with me. Who, who, who are you? Are you with me? Yes. I am. Who are you? My name is not to be revealed in this setting. You're an... You're an angel. I am honored to serve the sun who rules from the White Throne. That place back there. Why did I have to go there? You were waiting. Waiting? Waiting for what? <sighs> this... This is beautiful. It's more incredible than a... I had imagined, and yet somehow it's... it's terrifying. You are about to enter the Great Hall of the White Throne of Judgment. The Son who sits on the throne has beheld your heart. He knows your innermost thoughts and desires. Nothing is hidden. All right. You will approach when your name is called. At the gold rail you will kneel, where you will have a chance to address the Son of the Most High, the King of the Universe. Wait, you're, you're saying then that this will decide whether heaven or... As it is written, this is the most decisive and solitary moment you will ever face. Did you not read in the eternal scriptures of the King's Judgment Seat? Knowing therefore the terror of the Lord, we persuade men. May your name be found. Oh. Oh. It's so... It's also... It's also magnificent. It's so permeated with... God's love. And yet somehow I feel... Holy, holy, sacred fear. Come. No. All the things I worried about. How are we ever going to pay this off, Jeff? When are you going to shave that thing off your face? The board says they're going to evaluate my performance over the last two years. Terry, do you see that gray hair? Greg, I'm gonna have to declare your room a national disaster area. Yeah. Man, I think these pants must have shrunk in the wash. Oh, distractions. Foolishness. This is the moment I should have cared about. This is the moment that should have consumed me all my life. This is the moment I should have prepared for. My encounter with... Hal Newman, it is now time to give an accounting of your time on Earth. You'll be all right, my friend. You're one of the godliest men in my church. If you aren't accepted, then all my work has been for nothing. I am a... I served you, Lord. My whole life has been about serving your name. It's... Uh, it's 
been an honor, my lord. Gabriel. Is the name Hal Newman found in the Book of Life? Oh, what a blessing to be here to witness this. To see the reward no, of the good one. it is not, my lord. What? Hal Newman, you are guilty of denying me. You will be taken to the Lake of Fire, where you will spend eternity away from my presence no, no, in the company of Satan and his demons, no. and all those who have denied me. But Lord, how have I denied you? I accepted you as a boy. I've been a Christian my whole life. How can this be? Why? Gabriel, reveal the works of his life. Yes, my lord. Here's what you do. Give this envelope to my good buddy down at the Planning Commission. Well, he'll turn his head the other way. Just long enough for us to get the go-ahead to break ground on the project. It's that easy. Wait. I can get the sightings of that low? Sure. <laughs> I understand. Only good for five or six years? Yeah, well, hey. I'll be retired by then. Stanley. Relax, my friend. I've got several places we can hide the money, all right? Didn't you know I'm a CPA? <laughs> yeah. yeah. A creative person with a cow. <laughs> Dear God. Hal, I would have gladly forgiven you of these deeds. I died to give you that chance. If you had come to me, with a broken and contrite heart, I would have erased these deeds from all memory. But Lord... But you never knew me. And these deeds are merely evidence of what was in your heart all along. I am so sorry. I gave you many chances to repent in life. But out of your pride, you refused. You prayed a prayer decades ago. But it meant little. What? You never followed me. You never knew me. But Lord, I, I did many good things in your church. Why do you call me Lord? And yet you failed to do what I told you. Hell, you have never been. Lord. Now you must go away, for your deeds are evil. Oh. Find him hand and foot. No! Take him away. Cast him into outer darkness, where there will be weeping and gnashing of teeth. No! No! Don't flee! No! Nothing that is impure will enter the city, nor anyone who does shameful things or tells lies. Only those whose names are written in the Lamb's Book of the Living will enter the city. The throne of God and of the Lamb shall be in it, and his servants shall serve him, and they shall see his face. Listen says Jesus. I am coming soon. I will bring my rewards with me to give to each one according to what he has done. I am the first and the last, the beginning and the end. Happy are those who wash their robes clean and so have the right to eat the fruit from the tree of life and to go through the gates into the city.